story called Shelter from the Storm. It was a calm evening on Myrtle Road in Florida. The smell of ocean was in the air. It was spring and all the flowers had blossomed. It was a soft breeze. Six-year-old Jimmy Nail lived on Burrow Road. Her hair and brown and got beat, eyes were pretty. It was like that until a hurricane struck. It started to rain hard. The clouds started acting up. Somewhere in the distance, she heard thunder. Then the hurricane struck her house. From inside the house, she heard a blood shivering scream, the kind of scream that makes your blood shiver. Scream was from her parents. They were hurt, but Jimmy couldn't get to them. <coughs> Jenny yelled, help. Next door, Fiona Green, a girl of nine, heard her scream. Fiona wrote, ran out of her shelter and let Jenny into it. Inside it was warm, there were four chairs. Fiona's parents were also there. Fiona's dad said, hold the chair and get comfortable. Jenny was surprised. She had never heard somebody talk like that. Her parents said, sit down, not hold the chair. Thank you for letting me hear, said Jenny. You're welcome, said Fiona. They waited and joked until the hurricane stopped. Once it stopped, Jimmy found her parents, and they were okay. Sixteen years later, Jenny was 10, 22 years old. One night, she was sitting by the fire, thinking back about the hurricane and how Fiona and her family had given her help. She thought how there were lots of hurricanes each year and people who didn't have shelter during them. She decided she needed to help other to survive hurricanes. She went to town, a town hall meeting and proposed the business that would help people find shelter during hurricanes. She started to convince people that there should be a business like that. So she got permission to build a hurricane shelter in her town. It was a shelter that saved, helped the world.